Hey everybody, Molly here. How are y'all doing today? Well, I've got a new kit that I want to share with you for the month of February, and that's 2018 February, and it's centered around, you know y'all have heard me if you've watched some of my videos before, talking about this project kit. It's called Perennial Birthdays, and you get a box, and in it you get enough supplies to make 16, can I show you any harder? Okay, to make 16 cards, and they are fun and easy, and of course I had to change mine up a little bit when I was making them, but if you buy from my store, if you don't already have a Stampin' Up! demonstrator and you'd like to purchase through me, um, I'm going to show you what all you can get in addition to getting this fabulous set and all. So let's get started and let me show you. But if you're thinking about shopping, I just want to tell you, I hope you can see this and I hope it's not backwards. Is it backwards? It's KV6Q6GUY. Uh, anyway, that's the host code that you would use this month to be able to get some of the free things that I'm going to be showing you. And, okay, let's get started and see what comes in the kit and what you'd be making. Hold on just a minute. Let me show you what comes in the Perennial Birthday Project Kit. You get this cute little, you know, hard chipboard box covered with a cute little cording paper. happens to go with my craft room, but a kind of a recipe box style. comes with this little elastic closure. And inside of it, you get everything you need to make 16 cards. Now, I have some extra cards in there, but... So all the die cuts and ribbons and twines and uh, different things you need to make those 16 cards. In addition to that, you get these dividers, which there are stickers where you can put the months. But you would write like my birthday, my mother's birthday, my daughter-in-law's birthday, my sister-in-law, all of us in January. My husband's birthday's in February, going into March. So you'd write the different birthdays on there, and you'd have that from year to year. Make your cards, stick them behind there. It's a great idea, perennial birthdays. The four cards that come with that kit... There's a project sheet that you can see, and it shows you the four cards you'd make. Now, the stamp sets, as a reminder, do not come with the project kit. You have all the die cuts, ribbons, and things like that, and you could use some stamp sets you have at home, but if you'd like the coordinating stamp set, it's Picture Perfect Birthdays, and, oh, that's the wrong one. Hold on. It's Picture Perfect Birthdays. Excuse me. Excuse me. It's Picture Perfect Birthdays, and it coordinates. You see the flowers coordinate and everything there. Now, the first one I held up here, blooper, is uh, Picture Perfect Birthdays instead of Perennial Birthdays. This is the Perennial. This is the Picture Perfect. And I bought it to go with it because it's you can look candles and party blowers. And it's got a cute little mix of uh, text, you know, fonts in there and all. So I love this set coordinating with it. Those are sold separately from the project kit. Again, with the project kit, you get the die cuts, the ribbons, the card bases, all the stuff you need to make the cards, twines and things. And you could use stamps that you have at home. If you want the coordinating one, it's perennial birthday stamps, and it coordinates perfectly. And then I added the picture perfect. Okay, so here's the project sheet, and it shows you the four cards that you can make with this kit. Here's the first one. And you can see this is already printed, got little gold foil accents on it and all. And then there's the pretty gold ribbon. I changed the stamp out. They used one from the perennial birthdays. I used one from the picture perfect. Celebrate the good stuff. Here's to celebrating you, because get it, you're the good stuff. Okay, so there's one card. You get to make four of those with that kit. Here's the next card. <clears throat> Excuse me. So in the project kit, you can see they used just the print card you know, that's already printed for you, and then they used a tag, a little piece of ribbon, and a twine. Well, I changed mine up just a little bit. I took some flirty uh, flamingo, the pink paper, and used the stamp from the perennial birthdays, and just stamped pink on pink to make myself a background print to kind of add to that. And then I took the tag, and instead of just doing it straight up and down, I did it on a diagonal, stamped on the corner, stamped the flower, I added gold embossing accents, painted my leaves, and then I stamped a second one of those stamps in color, added some gold embossing, popped it up, so I think it made a little bit more dimensionals, and nothing inside the card. I didn't even stamp inside the card. Okay, we're going to put that one aside. Next in the project kit, let me show you, see right here, next is this darling card. Again, this is pre-printed, these are pre-cut, you just have to stamp on there, little piece of gold ribbon, little piece of twine, and you're good to go. So that's a darling card. Happy birthday. How cute is that? So this comes up with the balloons, this little die cut piece on the back, which I love. The only thing I did different here is I added a little bit of confetti dots to the edge 
of that, um, you know, banner to make it a little more party. Okay, so those are the cards that come with it. You get to make four of each one of them. Now, I made some additional cards. The other day, it was kind of rainy and well, and I just wanted to have fun, so I took out the perennial birthday stamp set, some whisper white paper, all the inks that coordinate, dapper, de uh, dapper denim, I actually use specific point, but it's dapper denim, the flirty flamingo, old olive, and then I use some um, berry burst and some, or melon mambo actually, and probably uh, Clipso coral and peekaboo peach, <coughs> which is another coordinating color. And so I stamped myself this. But I love how it came out. Of course, I had put a piece of post-it note just over the birthday. After I stamped the birthday first, put a piece of post-it note on it, and then did the flower layering around it, and used just a few pieces of the glitter um, embellishments on there. The little bee is from a different set of stamps. I think it's birthday blossoms, but uh, I'll have to check that and have it on my blog. But anyway, so I think that came out just a darling today blooms for you. Uh, okay. One of the other sets that I mixed in, or supplies, so to speak, that I mixed in is, of course, that Picture Perfect birthday stamp set and the papers, the 6 by 6 inch papers from the Picture Perfect um, birthday designer series papers. Those are darling, bright, cheery, fun-loving. One side is uh, photorealistic, the other side is a design. So you can see where I just stamped myself some candles, a little bit crooked, but oh well. Uh, used a piece of pool party twill ribbon you know, the chevron ribbon, some of that paper from that collection of designer series papers, and made your, get it, treat yourself, cookies. Okay, so I, <laughs> sorry, made myself a quick and easy card with there. Kind of goes with the thing. This card, real easy. I love this print paper. Just stamped a big old happy birthday. And then used some of the self-adhesive sequins. They're the Tutti, from the Tutti Fruity collection. And you can see how cute those are. Now, I am giving away... This month is my free thank, thank you to you. If you spend more than $60 in my Stamping Up store, if you don't already have a demonstrator and you'd like to purchase some things, or you're one of my customers already and you'd like to purchase some things, this month, February 2018, after the 10th, from the 10th to the 28th, if you spend $60, boy, that's a lot of fine print, huh? Anyway, you will get a free set of the sequins. They're darling. And you're going to get four card kits to make some birthday cards real quick. So that's not bad for with the $60 purchase. So this is one of the cards I made. Love it. Okay, this is a card I had already shown you a while back, but I'm going to show you again. It's made with that same paper, those same stamp sets. Here those little party things are. Now, this end, let's see if you can see it. Well, I can't see it better there. This little end piece that you see here, I just literally cut around. There's not a die, but I just cut around the edge, and then I came down and left the little blower part on there to make myself a party blower and use some of that pretty paper and the stamp sets from, I'm trying to keep a cat out of here, um, and the stamp set. Hold on, buddy, no. Okay, now, here's what else I want to show you. The four cards that I talked about that come um, as a gift with the sequins to you, if you spend more than $60 on any one purchase this month, uh, $60 in merchandise. You're going to get these four card kits. Now, if you don't buy the stamp sets, you're going to get just white uh, circles for me. You can use any stamps you want to fill in your circles. But if you get the stamp sets, I think you're going to really enjoy them. They are the uh, Picture Perfect stamp set. So I stamped the, the uh, balloons, excuse me, the candles, stamped a little sentiment, and then used some of this ribbon. Now this ribbon is from the um, Celebration set of ribbon that you can get free with the $50 purchase. Oh, just a note on that. If you spend $60 with me and you order it yourself through Stamping Up to come to you, of course you'll get you know, get to select a free celebration item. Yay! This set of ribbons is one of them if you'd like. But if you, if you order the kit through me, my class, I'm going to ask you to add, tell me what free celebration item you'd like, and of course I'll order that for you. But anyway, so here's the outside. So you'll get the glitter circles, the circles, the cute pieces of paper, all the layers, and then the card base and envelope. So there's one of the cards you'd get. Here's another one. I was in a glittery mood, can you tell? I used the uh, glimmer paper from the um, Myths and Magic or Magical Myths uh, collection. Oh, I love them. I pop them up on foam so it has a little dimension. Here's that balloon paper. So you'd get this card kit. Again, you're not going to get, if you don't buy this stamp, you won't be able to stamp this. It's from the Picture Perfect set, but you might have a stamp at home you want to, or you could just layer another piece of design or paper over that, but I think you'd really enjoy that stamp set.
Okay, here's the third one. You'll get the die cut Celebrate You out of the Glimmer paper. You'll get all these little pieces, this little piece of ribbon. And then again, if you don't buy the um, stamp set, you won't be able to do this fun stuff. But look how cute those candles are stamped. I love them. Now, I stamped them, and the, normally the middle up here is white. I just used my little uh, watercolor brush and added a little bit of flame color to that. So I like that kind of cheery. And then last, certainly not least, of the four sets. I don't know how this looks on camera, but this is mirror paper. That holographic mirror paper, which really adds a pop and pizzazz to that card. You'll get the glimmer paper background here, cord base, printed papers, and then a little piece of the ribbon so that you can make this cute card. I love it. So with a $60 minimum purchase, you'd get those four card kits and a complete set, mine are kind of used, of the uh, adhesive sequins from the Tutti Frutti collection. Aren't those darling? I love the colors and all. So that's what the February kit, class kit is going to be. Now if you order the whole uh, class kit from me, you're going to get the two stamp sets. You'd get the perennial uh, birthday project kit. You'd get enough, you'd get the free sequins, yay, and you'll get enough uh, supplies to make eight um, cards. Plus, in the kit, now I made it kind of big this month because I couldn't turn anything away. Uh, you'll get a full set of the designer papers, the 6x6 papers, and you would get the um, a full pack of the solids that coordinate with there. So that's a real big kit. Uh, it's just under $100, so class kit. But uh, it's, and I, when I say just under, I mean just under. But uh, just think that includes shipping, taxes, blah, 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 all that kind of stuff. So you get that whole kit. But you have to use the host code if you're ordering for yourself and wanting it shipped to you, and then I'll just send you the extras. Remember to use the host code KV6Q6GUY. Don't use that host code and you won't get the free extra things. If you use the host code, you will. So I appreciate that so much. And then if you buy the class kit from me, you'll get all oh, everything, everything. So love that. Uh, just wanted to share those things with you and hope you enjoy celebrating some wonderful birthdays this month and into the future. I think you'll really enjoy this collection of stamps and papers. I just can't ask for a more cheerful thing. And see, this to me added the cheerfulness to the... Let me see, reach over here and find these other things. So imagine your box filled up with all these fun cards. With the full class kit, you'll get enough to make 24 cards, plus you'll have all the supplies left over, and there's plenty of papers and things left over from the uh, class kit for you to keep making and making. If you buy just the things straight from Stampin' Up, you will you can make 16 cards, plus if you use my host code, you'll be able to make up to 20, so, you, you know, four extra for me, and the sequence. <coughs> Excuse me. Think you'll really enjoy this uh, class kit this month or buying these things from Stampin' Up and playing with them. I can just imagine one night um, making a whole bunch of birthday cards and feeling really great about yourself or have a granddaughter over, daughter, friend, whatever, and y'all just sit and make cards and make cards and make cards. It'll be a blast. Okay, thank y'all so much for watching. Just love everything. Thank you all to who bought the uh, kits last month. It was a pleasure putting them together for you. And I hope you enjoy the one this month. Thank y'all so much. Y'all have a great day. Bye-bye.